<laughs> Brad just caught a mongo. Start the vlog off, baby. Let's do it. <laughs> Brad just oh swamped an absolute monster, boys. Holy smokes. Yeah, so it's about three pounds. Yeah. It's all you. No, I'm just getting extra stuff. Monsters to start the vlog, boys. That's how you do it. What is going on? We're coming at you from Dallas, Texas. Today it's going to be me, my buddy Brad, and Josh. And then we got Abby over here. We're hitting the banks at the golf courses. We got kicked out of last time, but we only got kicked out of that side. Apparently, this pond is fair game. And so we just like to, you know, cast some cranks, catch some three pounders. The boys are actually up from San Antonio, Texas. Got to give them credit for making the drive. Yes, Super sir. sick, man. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Uh, they've been hitting us up on Instagram since like September 10th. It's the 22nd today. So we've been talking for almost a couple weeks about uh, linking up, doing some fishing, and then luck would have it, they get on a big one. So we're out here throwing the Guggen Squad lures and the Guggen Bait soft plastics. Right now we've got a Mondo worm going. We've had some bangers getting chunked. I'm throwing the Bandito bug on the back of a jig. But I want to talk to you guys about inspiration and what got us started in all this because it's funny that we're even fishing together. Both of us got inspired by the Guggen Squad to start. He's been watching them since the eighth grade. Uh -huh. Senior in high school now. Yeah, senior in high school, so about five years now. So, yeah, tell a little yeah. bit about that. Like, so I subscribed to them when they were about 200K and I've really watched them ever since I was like eighth grade. And me and my friend, we were just like watching them consistently for five years. I still remember one of their very first videos that they posted when AP had the chartreuse color and blue water. They really inspired me to get out and start fishing a little more and really start my main YouTube channel. I uploaded my very first video two years ago, all inspired by them. So go ahead. Give him a like and comment on some of his videos. Head over there, check them out, and we're gonna get back to fishing. We don't want to delay any longer because obviously the biggins are biting and we're over here talking, so let's go. Whoa. Sir, right there, ladies and gents. Smash the recon. Uh, I think I'm the only one that hasn't caught a fish. Have I caught a fish? I don't think I've caught any fish today. I kind of did have one bite the Mondo worm, but it wasn't a catch, man. I didn't land him. Oh, a little guy's biting it. That was so crazy! No luck in the juice zone, man. Very unusual. Let's uh, walk across the sidewalk and get back to the other pond. <laughs> Thought I had one. <laughs> Here he said this side's cool. He said this pond is all, all fair game. We did it the golf community so that you know between the two they, they would be liable should God forbid anything happen. I got no authority or anything. I can't make you leave, but it's all good. Yes, Bill's sir. playing today? Yes, sir. They're yes, gonna win sir. or what? Who are they playing? I hope so. Cincinnati. Yeah? Yeah, it's, oh, it'll be a tough dude. one, you know. <laughs> they, the Cowboys got it easy. Yeah, they I'm got just gonna the try dolphins. and watch the boys, we'll see what happens. Yeah, That's well, what I hear. It's gonna they be got the no dolphins, it's gonna be over like the yeah. first or second drive. No so. no point in watching them. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yeah, I hope. I hope. They, they've been, what, I've scored 100 to like three. That's what I hear. two games. Dude, so. It's nuts. Yeah. All right, well, we're going to grab our stuff. We'll get out of here, man. I appreciate, appreciate it. You guys have a good one. You too. All right, y'all. We just got the boot. It's time to take this three quarter mile walk of shame back to the vehicles. We got a little bit of a trek in front of us. Just, y'all won't have to worry about all that. We're just going to skip to the next pond probably in like two seconds. So, no stress for y'all. But, uh,. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get back there. I got to get some more GoPro batteries. I might grab the sunglasses. We're going to hit another spot because honestly, the first pond we fished kind of sucked. And then the second one produced. That was awesome. We should have just started there, but you know, that's just hindsight. You can't always. Should have known, man. Ah, all right, better luck next time. Let's go. All right, here we go. Just rolled up to spot number two and making its debut on the channel. Aside from the unboxing is the Jackal Gantrell Jr. in this black and blue with yellow tail. Honestly, the clarity is fairly decent at this spot. I don't know if this is the best thing to throw, and I honestly don't care either. I haven't got any fish today, so we're gonna try it and see what happens. Weird. It's just kind of like the summertime blues, but, I, but when you find the bite, it's like decent. All right, guys, we are at what is probably the last spot of the day at 1.14 in the afternoon. 
and it's looking pretty good. It's looking mighty fine. I think we ought to fish off this bridge over here, and then also the pond on the other side of that bridge is usually good. Let's see what happens. I forget what a bite feels like. Instagram photos, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, man, usually in here with the Texas rig is like, usually gets it done, but. Texas, y'all. Oh, 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 don't with me. It's little pecs, it's little pecs, dude. It's little pecs. You, I think it's bluegill, dude. Cause did you see that? Like that was not, yeah. It, it was never like a substantial, like I've got it. Yep. Unless that was just a tiny dude. Look at my line. Oh boy. Oh boy. First bites of the day. Would you believe it? <laughs> Skeet! Oh, oh, oh! No! He let it go! No! 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 Did I just get hit on the way down? Oh no! I just got hit on the drop. I think he took the crawl. He took the whole thing. I think I broke off. It was definitely a bad one. I broke off right like as soon as it hit the water. I don't know what the deal is, but I've been breaking off on 30 pound braid left and right. Dang, this dude's probably not hungry anymore and I think that was a good one. Dang it! Because it was the fall that enticed him. Like, you gotta get lucky and cast on the right spot. Yeah. I've been popping it and just getting grass. Oh, that's not good. I wonder if he just took me behind a rock or something and when I said it, it kind of, like, I'm wondering what did that because I don't think it was the fish. I haven't seen any dogs, no. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, got it. I'm going to save it and if I see him, I'll give you a shout. Summertime blues. What are they doing? You know? Well, y'all, it has been a tough day. Tough day. I think I've probably hit seven, eight ponds by the time it's all said and done because we went to four or five ponds and a lot of them were multiple ponds, meaning it's like a spot where there's multiple ponds to fish. This one right here was two, past one was two, the one before that was two, and man, I'm telling you what, the bite has been tough today. We snagged a few this morning, not me, but the gang, and so congrats to them. Be sure to check out the channel, yes. boom, and boom. boom, and we will catch you guys on the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll probably even catch some fish on the next one. How about that? Boom.